So I'm going to show you how to do some basic formulas in Excel. And these can be made to be very elaborate or they can be as simple as just adding or subtracting things from each other. Um, so as my example, I'm going to be calculating mean arterial pressure um, from systolic blood pressure and diastolic blood pressure. And so the calculation for that, I just type it up here for it to be easier to see, is mean arterial pressure equals one-thirds systolic blood pressure plus two-thirds diastolic blood pressure. All right, so um, back to our Excel here. Um, so again, we have these columns with systolic blood pressure, columns with diastolic blood pressure, and then the empty column that we need to calculate. Um, so in order to do this, um, we're just going to always start formulas with an equal sign. So I'm going to hit equal sign first. And then I'm going to start typing uh, the, the basic math here. So 1 divided by 3, so 1 thirds. And then the asterisk symbol, symbol in Excel is the uh, multiplication symbol. So 1 thirds times the systolic blood pressure. So I'm going to click on the cell that the systolic blood pressure is in for this particular per, uh, participant. And then we're going to add that. So let's hit the plus sign to 2 thirds the diastolic blood pressure, which here is the diastolic blood pressure for this participant. And then we can just hit enter, and there's our number. So um, 100 is, 101 is the mean arterial pressure for this particular participant. And we can then copy this formula uh, down so we don't have to type that every time. Um, so if you look at this little um, tiny box that my, uh, my cursor is on top of right now, so this little tiny box right here in the bottom right-hand corner of the cell, when that, that little tiny box is there, you can click it, and you can drag formulas, and it will calculate the formulas. And it's using what's called relative referencing. So although we type the formula up here, and it's going to the cells um, to the left of that formula, if we go down to the other formulas that we um, sort of were able to fill down while um, clicking that little box in the bottom right-hand corner, and we look, it's looking at the cells that are to the left of it. So the relative formatting or relative referencing, meaning it's going to be looking at the cells in the same relative spot as the original formula, but to this new cell. So um, another way to do it is and to get this formula all the way down. The rest of the way I'm going to do this is you can just simple, simply double click on that little box in the corner, and it's going to fill down until all the cells are filled that have data next to them. Um, and so that's a really simple way to uh, fill down a, a formula to hundreds of rows if you have that. All right, so again, real quick how to do formulas in Excel. And these can be done in much more elaborate ways than that. But hopefully that was a simple enough explanation for you. All right, so hope that helps.